Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori, and I'm at the pool house today and thought I would give you a quick little overview. So this is the house outside of the pool at the condos I live at. This is the main seating area. The pool is out there, but it's a rainy day, so nobody's at the pool today. But nicely, we do have a grill out there. And then from this side, we do have a fireplace. I have no idea if it works or not. Over there is where the pool is. There's an office and some storage back there. And then over here, we have like a little gathering space with tables and chairs, and then a bar area. And then behind it, there's all kinds of cabinetry and a full kitchen, a refrigerator, yeah, a TV. I don't know how to work it. It doesn't matter. We're not using it. Yeah, this little nook over here. Love these tables and chairs. Maybe I'll come up and clean them one day. A little worse for the wear. But yeah, this is the pool house where we'll be having the party today. Okay, friends. I had my picnic with my coworkers. And I just got out of the gym. I definitely do not like gymming at five in the evening, but I didn't have a choice because I wouldn't get out of bed this morning. I know. So, whew got my towel. I need to wash that. I just did two miles. It took me 35 minutes on the elliptical. I'm trying to work my way up to an hour. I get bored. I think that's my problem. I do listen to music, but I need to come up with a better playlist. I think I need to get on Spotify and create myself a playlist. Ice water because we need cold water. And our nose. I'm peeling too. All right, so next plan, next stop, next step. I'm cooling off for a minute, stop sweating, and then right here is Big Lots. I'm gonna run in there, I need some water. I need a better gym cup than a bicycle one. So I'm gonna look for one with a bigger opening that's not as difficult while I'm on the elliptical. Then I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna work on a baby blanket. A while ago I bought this yarn, and I'll show you when I get home, at the Dollar Tree, but it's actually Burnett yarn that they sell at like Joanne and Michaels. It's name brand yarn. It just happened to be at the Dollar Tree and I'm making a baby blanket. Crocheting, not even knitting, I know. And I'm gonna work on that this evening and yeah, I need to see also Hopefully the screws came for my chair. I don't know if I told you. My furniture came, which I will show you tomorrow when I finish tidying up the room. But when they got here to deliver the chair, the screws that go into the feet, gone. Too short, don't fit. Came with nine screws. So eight screws that I need plus an extra and six of them, seven of them were too short. Two were the right length, seven were too short. And they were like, well, we can return it, but we don't know when we'll get you another chair. I said, oh, no, no, you're not leaving my house with this chair. So, um, I ordered screws on Amazon. I went to Home Depot, their metric, they didn't have any in stock of the size I need, so I ordered what I think I need on Amazon. We'll see. If not, I can return it. But um, they're supposed to be delivered today, maybe tomorrow, but they were supposed to be here today. So I can put the feet on my chair. It's fine. I'm just sitting, it's sitting on the ground, and I would prefer it not to do that. So, and then I will work on my just relaxing a little bit. I need to make some coffee because I've only had one today. And then we will um, do some crocheting and I will show you. But first I need to go into the store. So I'll be back. Good morning. 
All right, guys. I'm in London, Ohio on a bike ride. Taking a break, Speedy and I. Gone 11 miles. We're stopping here at this church and this is the 11 mile mark and I'll turn around and ride my bike back another 11 miles to my car. Such beautiful country. The trail's a little rough and by rough, I mean it's a slightly up and down all the time, no coasting here. That's the way I'm going back. And I'm literally riding through farm country the whole way. It is so beautiful out here. What is the saying? Tell me you live in the Midwest without telling me you live in the Midwest. Here we go. Although I don't feel like Ohio's the Midwest. I mean, on the map wise, I mean, maybe personality wise we are. I don't know. Who I'm hot. It's uh, 9.20 in the morning. So I've been on this at this for an hour and I got one more hour to go and then I have plans today. So let's get moving. All right, friends, here's the new furniture. It's kind of a mess in here. I haven't finished everything up yet. Um, and I don't know if I'm leaving it in this direction, but here we have Alex. Hi, baby and my baby blanket i'm working on that's with some yarn i got at the dollar tree it's burnout but there is the chair ottoman is in blue i bought separate and my dollar tree wall um my dining room my house is kind of in flux right now i don't know where i'm putting everything that chair really doesn't match anymore but the cats kind of like it so there's that the bed, my mantle, and I think I found a home for my rose forever. Um, if this is something you're interested in, this is not a sponsor video, but I did receive them free. There's a link, I believe, for a discount down below. I like them. Yes, they're expensive, but they do last a long time, and they have a really lovely scent to them. So I thought they looked pretty on the mantle. Got my TV up here. Fireplace is clean. And then I went with a love seat because my living room is small. Yeah, let me get over here. So I went with a love seat instead of a couch. Plus, it's just me. I need something to hang up on the wall up there. And I have so many pillows, guys. That came with <laughs> the furniture. I'm probably going to give them to my niece or some, like, a family member if they want them. Because I have so many pillows. And I like the ones these. They're goose down. And I can just buy covers for them to change up things in here. And then over here, this is just my bay window. <laughs> I have a fan blowing because it's been warm and I've been cleaning. I don't know if I ever showed you that, but that's, I got it for Christmas from my sister-in-law. It's a stained glass of my boys. Some, a lady by where she lives made it for me. And then all the plants, I do need to do some new planting. And plants outside but that's it that is everything in the living room all the new furniture I'll do some resetting up in here I have a box of books that still have not gone to the bookstore things that need to go to the car I need to run the vacuum there's these little I'm not sure where they keep coming from I keep vacuuming little pieces of foam from when they delivered the furniture oh and I found screws. I ordered them on Amazon so I could put the legs on the chair. Yeah. And those are all the cat and dog toys. For anybody who knows, I do not have a dog, but I have a niece with a dog who comes over who's on her way right now. So she has her own little toys here. And I probably should take the tag off, but there's that. All right. That is everything for the tour. It's time for dinner. And for those of you doing low carb, low sugar, White Claw iced tea is not bad for an adult beverage. But anyway, keto dinner, but really it's good for anybody. So I have the oven heating up to 350 and I have leftover hamburgers. So what I did is I sprayed some aluminum foil a little bit of cooking spray just because it will stick. There's cheese involved. 
And then I just put a little bit of pasta sauce, like a marinara. I'm using currently this tomato basil. And then when this is done, I do have some that's actually lower in carbohydrate than that in the fridge, but let's not be wasteful. So just put a little scoop on each. And then I'm taking just some mozzarella and I'm li literally making a pizza burger, guys. But this will be a perfect dinner with leftovers and it's gonna give it a whole nother flavor, you know? Which is what I like. Because yesterday I had it like a hamburger, but today, and I am making two. I don't know if I'll be able to eat two. I'm hungry after my bike ride today, but if I can't eat two, which is okay, I will save one and have it for lunch tomorrow. Just heat it up in the microwave. This one I'm putting in the oven. And then I have just some Parmesan cheese. And if I have pepperoni, I would put that on top. I don't, I'm not gonna worry about it. But I'm just gonna toss these in the oven and let the burger warm up and the cheese melt. And then I will show you what it looks like when it comes out. I mean, that is super easy. And in summertime, we do cookouts a lot, barbecues, and we have leftovers. And this just kind of transforms it. You don't need two pans. I had two pans in my oven, so I'm just being lazy. And I'm not even waiting for the oven to hit 350. <laughs> I'm just sticking it in there. All right, I'm gonna clean up the kitchen and then I'll chat with you. Dinner's done. So here's what it looks like. Just a burger with some pizza toppings. Let's see. Yep, that's good. Good use of a leftover hamburger. I gotta change my trash bag. Got my house almost tidied up. What is it, buddy? All right. Somebody wanted to come say hello. Say hello. No? I don't know what he wants. He doesn't know what he wants. So that's delicious. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna get your treat. Yesterday when I went to Big Lots, I think I told you before I went to the gym, or after the gym, I found these big boxes of the like drink mixes. I have never seen this before, um, but you get 40, I'm trying to open the box. I'm not gonna use them yet, but you get 40 and this one comes with orange, grape, strawberry, and peach. And then, I'm sorry, what, Skittles? Skittles flavors, what? And it's much more cost effective to buy them this way because you get 40. When you buy them individually, you only get six in a box. You're getting four, for $4, you're getting like 16 more drink mixes. So that's great. So I grabbed one of each. I'm not gonna do anything until I use up what's in the refrigerator. Um, but I think these will be really good for adult popsicles. Hi, buddy. What do you want? So I don't know what I'm going to do the rest of the night. It's 6 o'clock. i got to edit this video. And then I'm going to bed. I have a doctor's appointment in the morning. Just a checkup. My hair is a mess. I need to get a shower. I went um, to the pool. What do you want, baby? I went to the pool after I went bicycle riding and had lunch with my brother Sarah my niece and his wife Ellen for Father's Day so we just met over at a restaurant by here and then Sarah and I I'm gonna get you some milk honey Sarah and I went swimming for a little bit so warm out today that's everything I hope you enjoyed it was a little busy weekend for me but I will talk with you later bye